Welcome to Star Tuesday once more. With me is nobody. That's fine. <laughs> yeah, people are talking about the LP zone, uh, which is Bob's new um, forum for Let's Play, so you should go check it out. I uh, I tested it. I was one of the testers. It's pretty. It's pretty solid. There's only a couple like tweaky, you know, little, little tiny things to fix. Okay, I gotta fix this stuff, by the way. Speaking of fixing stuff... Nope. Gotta do this, then... This, I think... Yes, and then back to windowed. Alright. <laughs> it doesn't look like it changes anything. Uh, if you're watching this, but if I'm playing it, it certainly does. <laughs> it changes some stuff. Wait, we should watch uh, TV. It's been so- it's been a while since I played Stardew, so I'm a little foggy now. Oh my god, it's gonna snow tomorrow. A little extra luck today. Alright. I don't know why I have an emerald on me. Was I gonna give it to somebody? Hmm, maybe it's somebody's birth. Day. <laughs> I don't... Hmm, I don't really know. But I think I might have done some grinding off screen. I don't remember. Oh! A duck feather, finally. And I'm waiting for this this baby to make a, make a fat egg for me. I think the duck feather is something we can add to the... Um, the community center, if I'm not mistaken. Let me check that. Oh, not this one. Still waiting on that egg. Waiting on that egg. Don't have a, don't have a sheep. No, it's for something. It's for like the the dye bundle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, it it, it is for something. All right. Let's save that. This is just garbage. <laughs> one egg. Can't believe it. All my animals are letting me down here. Oh man, I'm like really paying attention to how much I'm bouncing my leg right now. I'm trying not to bounce my leg because I've, I've been stressed out. <laughs> Gee, I wonder why. There's only like 87 reasons to be stressed out right now. Not on Stardew's Day. Stardew's Day is, is chill. Oh, she's making us a new barn. I forgot about that. That's what we have in the, uh, on the to-do list. Oh, I forgot to put away the pail. <gasps> Only 87 things. Hmm. <laughs> um, so yeah, let's see if it's anybody's birthday, because I feel like I'm carrying this emerald around for some, some sort of reason. Who knows? I'm just gonna throw this plum away. Who cares? Get out of my life, plum. Yep, stress is not allowed on Stardew's Day. It is a pleasant time for pleasantries. I need a cave carrot. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I can give you a cave carrot. That's not that's not hard. Is it someone's birthday? No, but it is Evelyn's birthday soon. Also, I should have the um, the wiki up. I'm out of practice here. Yeah, who likes emeralds? Pretty much a lot of people do. <sighs> Emily loves them, so it was pro it was probably for Emily. <laughs> Um, I should look up what Evelyn likes, because it's her birthday tomorrow. She likes diamonds and chocolate cakes and a lot of stuff that I can't get my hands on, so... Whatever. Oh, look at those handsome chickens! Oh, they're pretty! Real-life chickens in real life! Oh my goodness. Little British chickens. Wonderful. Uh, yeah, I guess I'll give that shit to, uh... Oh, that's right. They're not open yet. I don't really need anything anyway. It's winter. What am I thinking? Should give this to Emily. 
lady we're trying to get up in, <laughs> get in on. We're like pretty... Oh, that's right, Linus is uh, <laughs> are also BFFs with Linus. Here you go, it's Emerald. Oops. Looking, looking pretty good. <laughs> Why is there no music in here? It's awkward. <laughs> Let's put that feather away. Oh man, those are really good names for chickens. <laughs> oh man, Charlotte and... Gertrude? Oh my god. No, Ermintrude and Gertrude and Felicity. I've never heard of Ermintrude. That's a, is that a real name? Are there people in this world named Ermintrude? Okay, I just need a cabbage and a sunflower. I gotta, gotta work on that. Although maybe those things are, it is Friday, maybe those things are at that um, little caravan that we've been seeing around on Fridays and Sundays. It's, it's a real thing, huh? Never ever heard of Ermintrude. No, never ever write, uh, write a song about Sibby. <laughs> never ever ever heard about Ermintrude. I like the name Gertrude, but not for a person. <laughs> the only reliable way to get sunflowers to grow one. I don't know, I feel like I might have seen that Somewhere, I might have seen one somewhere else, but I, I'm not counting on that. Ah, uh, soon it will be spring once more. Then we can, oh look, it's like one of those things that are useless and bad. Don't fucking do anything. <laughs> oh my god, Kit Harrington. That's really funny. <laughs> Uh. <laughs> um, are we a full season away from getting the greenhouse? I'm gonna cry. <laughs> Cause I think the only thing we fucked up is pumpkins, right? Not that one, this one. Pumpkins or parsnips, that's spring. Parsnips is, is I'm pretty sure parsnips is spring. Mostly sure. And I think we could do it with parsnips. I still have two out of three decent pumpkins, but... Oh, maybe we can do it. Um, I need a cave carrot. Let's put these away. Why not? I have horseradish, but... Does Krobus have any, like, I know you can give horseradishes to Krobus. Does he have any, like, and like, um, cutscenes? Why could I not think of the, the, the name cutscenes? Oh, I have chocolate cake, so I'm gonna save that for old lady. Because I don't, I mean, I do have diamonds, don't I? I've got a lot of diamonds. Oh, I'd rather- the chocolate cakes are harder to come by than diamonds, so I'll keep the diamonds around. Alright, everything else makes sense. Who wanted this cave carrot? Was it Gus? I think it was Gus. Never heard of the defenestration of Ermintrude. <laughs> Sounds like a fake story in some other piece of media. Hey, here we go. Hey, buddy. Yes. Thanks. How you doing, Professor Gascan? Am I like. You know, maybe I'm, um, I think, I'm not certain, but I think maybe my watering can is at the blacksmith's. I'm not sure. 
Oh, it's the origin of the word defenestration. Interesting. I love that word. Oh, I guess not. All right. Um, I guess I don't really need a water raccoon because I'm going to have like a million sprinklers anyway, right? I got I to gotta check these. I got to check them. Okay, I made it. She didn't see me. <laughs> Yeah, winter is the best time to upgrade all of your all of your stuff because you don't need it. You don't need any of this 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 uh this junk basically. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Is that the scariest delivery ever, or what? <laughs> Ooh. Spooked me. What was I doing? I got spooked. <laughs> uh, but yeah, you don't like really need your hoe in the winter. It's just for like worms. You don't really need your anything. Oh my god, wool! <gasps> Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 <laughs> Anything else good in here? <gasps> Farm police. <laughs> oh my god. I just got wool. Holy shit. That's great. <laughs> this game just opened up to me. Because <laughs> we need that wool for the thing. And then all that's left in that one category is is the, the quality crops, which is going to take a little while. But hey, we got wool. That's cool. It didn't cost that much money. I got, I got a bunch of money. <clears throat> Yeah. Nice. Uh. Okay, cheese press. I already I don't have enough of those cheese. Those are cheese presses. Wait, I did get pumpkins. Melons. That's what it is. Yeah, that's like summer. I think parsnips is. Pretty sure parsnips is spring. So we're not we're not totes fucked on the greenhouse. We're just fucked for this winter, obviously. Um. Maybe I should get my watering can jazzed up just a little. For the heck of it. See if I can make it in time. I don't know if I can. I forget to the. I think he closes at six, but his. I don't know. Let's find out. Oh. No. Nine to four. Okay. Well, whatever. Uh, let's go to Cory. Get some ding dang rocks. I really don't know if you just clear out the whole place or if having some of the rocks around like makes other things populate differently. I don't know. Hello, Peep. I don't think I've seen you in the chat before. How are you? <laughs> uh, but yeah, I didn't finish my thought earlier. You should check out Bob's new Let's Play forum, LP, the Let's Play Zone, the Lipa Zone. 
it's the it's let's play dot zone, which is really cool. It's a cool name for cool for a cool site with cool peeps on it so far. A torta. I want a torta. Well, let's put this cheese maker over here, I guess. I guess let's do some fishing, why the heck not? Oh, that sucked. Fishing is the easiest way to make money in this game in general. Is there a specific reason the new Let's Play site was made? Uh, well, a couple reasons. Something Awful's been steadily getting a little worse and weirder over time. And, uh, Lotex kind of recently had a bit of a meltdown. Uh, you know, just that time of year, I guess. I don't know. Um. Every, every couple of years he has, like, a little midlife crisis -y sort of, uh, bad time. And he kind of takes it out on the forums, usually. Uh, so yeah, there's been more racism, more sexism, more homophobia, more transphobia. It kind of, like, got back to those unfortunate roots. Um, oh my god, I have too many rocks. Man, I'll just sell these six rocks. Uh, and he, he banned me for something I said on Twitter to him that wasn't even, uh, very mean. <laughs> Uh, so I, yeah, I can't post on LP anymore. He also banned like a couple other LPers and some other LPers self-banned, uh, I guess in solidarity or whatever, I don't know. But, you know, I can't speak for them, but it was kind of a mess. And also like he got rid of a lot of mods that were pretty nice and liberal mods and, um, oh, a seed maker. Hmm. Uh... And also a lot of mods resigned because of that, shena all those shenanigans, so a lot of weird drama recently happened, and there was this one, um, there was this one forum, uh, one thread, rather, that was about, you know, discussing, um, issues that affect black people, but, like, it was called, like, what was it called, like, Coontown or something stupid? I don't remember. Or was that the Reddit? The, the subreddit that got banned? I don't know. It had, it had a very... Uh, un PC name, but it was a PC related thread, and like to keep to keep. Oh yeah, Nigger Town. Oh God, why would you call it that in the first place? Jesus. But so <laughs> so yeah, that was the name of the thread. God knows why. I don't know the history of that thread. Negro. That's right. It was Negro Town. Yeah, the other one was the subreddit. But yeah, lots of yikes. Needless to say. But and then like. To keep the, like, SJW talk out of other- Because that was previously in, like, the debate and discussion subform or something like that? I want to say. Um, and to keep that stuff, like, separate but equal. <laughs> he, like, basically moved them to their own subforum that was also called Negro Town. Uh, so that doesn't look good, <laughs> you know? So, there was just a lot of- a lot of weird fucking nonsense happened, and it's like, well, it's not so cool no more. Oh, look, I finally got my large egg now that I don't need it. So yeah, this is like one of those final straw things for a lot of different people. <laughs> totally understandably so. Yeah, I, I agree, Gordonzilla. I think it was a lot of... Um, just a lot of, like, early 2000s, late 90s sort of style humor, and it's like, ugh, like, can we grow up a little, or no? And the answer's no. Um, but yeah, it's a lot of, you know, low tax placing, a lot of, m you know, misplaced angst and anger onto people that don't deserve that. You know, there, there's some other things that happen too, but it's not, it's not worth talking about. It's just, it's just stupid and awful. And like, a lot of it has to do with Schmorky, who is now known as a pedophile, so whoopsies. 
Um, to say the fucking least, whoopsies. Um, so yeah, a lot of problems happened, needless to say. And also, fuck that guy, so... <laughs> fuck, fuck all these people, <laughs> they're not so good. Um, so yeah, there's pretty, pretty good reasons to, um, <laughs> make a different... Make a new sub for him, I think. Yeah, if you were to visit SA modern day, I don't, you know, most people with a conscience uh, or sense of morals would probably not want to be involved, so I totally get that. Yeah, I don't regret being on SA in general, but I do regret what it turned out to be eventually. It's just, uh, it's just unfortunate. Like, it didn't have to be that way. <laughs> oh, a cutscene! Oh, probably with, with George or with Harvey? I don't know. I think I gave Harvey some coffee the other day, I'm not sure. Grumble, grumble. Oh god, just let George die. <laughs> hey, am I interrupting anything or uh or what? <laughs> I just leave the cutscene. <laughs> no, you should listen to your doctor. <laughs> Don't even have to think about that. That's how I feel in real life. <laughs> Yeah, um, the mustache is terrible. If only he didn't have the mustache. I want a second opinion from a non-doctor. I'm gonna go on Facebook and see what freedom.eagle says about my health. <laughs> yep, okay, I suppose that was for Harvey. Let's give this diamond to this old lady. It's your birthday! I have a diamond! <laughs> Did his mustache disappear in the smiling portrait? Oh man, fucked up if true. Freedom.eagle. <laughs> uh, it's just something like me and Chip have been joking about people getting like bad fake news from Facebook and it's always from like these sites you've never ever fucking heard of. Like Facebook.freedom.eagle. It's like... <laughs> Oh, I to, it's copper. Hey. Fair. Oh, I got very good at copper. Don't go to lp.eagle. <laughs> yeah, there's like a lot of weird garbage websites that I've been seeing on Facebook recently and it's like, oh my god, you people, why can't you read the the URL is so suspicious. What <laughs> Yeah, legal dot eagle. <laughs> yeah. All sorts of crazy sources. Like, why do you trust this? Who are these people? What's the source? Huh? Thanks for watering can, buddy. Clippity cloppity. Hi, Mayor. I mean, howdy. Yeah, like, go to your Facebook right now if you follow any old people and <laughs> tell me what what the URL of the articles are. Not not the full one, of course, just like, you know, the, the, the website's name. It's like, it'll always be something completely bizarre sounding that is so scammy. Yeah, it links to shit like that. <laughs> oh man. I just want to like reteach old people how to critically think about stuff, but I don't think they ever 
I don't know. Reteach implies that they learned it at some point, so I don't really know if that's a thing. Man, there's too many witnesses. I can't I can't go into these trash cans. Damn it. Damn it. I'm pretty glad I don't follow like pretty much any of my family on Facebook. Uh sometimes I look over my boyfriend's shoulder and on his Facebook. Unfortunately he does follow some chunks of family and Oh boy! <laughs> Oh boy, real bad stuff there. Real overtly, horrendously racist aunts and uncles he's got. Uh, Michigan. Michigan. So that's a shame. <laughs> I just like never friended my family back in the first place because I was like, this stuff's private. I'm like a weird person. You're not gonna- <laughs> you're not gonna like the stuff you're gonna read here. It's just like, you know. When I used to use it when I was in college, it was like pictures- pictures of me in college doing like totally weird bizarre shit because I went to an art school. So it's like, my parents, my family doesn't need to see that shit. What should I be doing right now? In life, but also in this game. What should I be doing? Fucking truffles. I, don't, I just need two. I need three. <laughs> truffles. Apparently, there's something. Somebody foreshadowed something in the comments once, and it was that apparently there's something you can do in this tunnel. And I'm- I'm very... It's very mysterious. What's this? A battery-powered lockbox, but there's no battery in it. What? I have a battery. Vroom. 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 <laughs> a battery-powered lockbox. What the fuck? Pretty sure I have one of those. Oh my god, yes. Do I need one or is it like one of those like double A situations? I'm gonna bring two just in case. You never know. What is this mystery that I've never seen before? Legit, never seen. Someone's knocking on somebody else's door. Pretty loud. Man, that's sneaky. First test, bring a rainbow shell to the train platform. Oh, I definitely do not have one of those things. <laughs> what? Oh my god, what the fuck? Alright, um, so that's mysterious as hell. A rainbow shell? Hmm. I'm gonna look up rainbow shell, because I don't even know if I've ever seen one before. Rainbow shell. Have I? Oh! I might have one of those, actually. Do I have one of those saved? I know what those- it's the Mega Man looking shells. <laughs> they look like Mega Man's Mega Buster. Here at least. Oh. Hmm. Why do I have so many pumpkins in here? Um. <laughs> maybe, maybe I don't have that. Oh. I don't know if I would call them incredibly rare spawns. I've, I've seen them before. Hmm. Well then. Welly, welly, well. Man, let's make some gold. Why not? Only well, spawn on the beach in the summer. I could have swore that I saved one of those, but huh? I had two in, in the fridge. Whoa. Why was I keeping them in the fridge? I thought that was an eggplant. Oh, you're right. I thought that was an eggplant. Chilled shells. You never. 
You never know when you're going to keep a shell a little bit chilly. They're not rainbow. It's rainbow. Oh, okay. I see what you mean. But yeah, they're not rainbow looking at all. They look like the Mega Buster. Mysterious mysteries await. Man, I just glazed right over that. I thought that was something else. Thanks for pointing that out, chat. Uh, train station. This? This thing. Do this thing. Mm. Oh, maybe it's that thing. Okay. Place 10 beets in the mayor's fridge. I definitely don't have those. <sighs> oh. When do beets grow? Let's look that up. They grow in the fall. Fuck. That is the opposite time that I need. Is that tree blocking a cave in the corner. No, no, that's like a weird... <laughs> that's a weird thing. It's this thing. She doesn't know what that is yet. <laughs> no, there's nothing else back there. And the, the other things don't go anywhere. Yeah, <laughs> this is just to trouble the mayor in a very subtle, not, you know, not inconvenient sort of way. <laughs> well, taking a while to do stuff there. Ah. Missed. Mm -hmm. A little Baba Yaga house. Crazy fish. Not missed. Put a horse's head in Sean's bed. What up? We just a fishing. Fishing the rest of our evening away. Nah, it's just that I have the the, the highest level of fishery. Fishing is so hard when you start out with, like Fishing is ridiculously hard when you when it first starts because everything's so low level and shitty and ugh, squirrely. But yeah, the more you fish, not only the better you get, but the easier it gets gameplay-wise because they give you a longer bar to keep behind the fish and all that stuff. Early fishing is like ridiculous. Oh, this is pretty bad without bait. <laughs> Ugh, did you hear my neck snapping there? Sorry. <laughs> Yeah, I was watching Chip play Final Fantasy XV's fishing games, and they look they look pretty hard. You seem pretty uh, addicted to it, though. So, it was very dramatic. 
played that like really dramatic like monster fighty sort of soundtrack every time he caught something. Yeah, that was me uh, cracking my neck. Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. Troubles in the world. Just fish. Just fish. They're all happy fish and they all get along in this lake. They don't even eat each other. They're just nice neighbors. <laughs> Oops, I'm out, I'm out of puddle. Bo Bofor? That sounds like a Bofa joke. Like Bofa D's nuts joke. What's Bofor? Bofor D's nuts. That's how I imagined the bad joke would go. <laughs> Okie Yeah, Bofur is one of the doors in The Hobbit. Oh my god, you're right. <laughs> hey, I got some cash here. Getting close to the end of winter, guys. Getting close. Nine more days of winter. <laughs> Snow tomorrow. Whoa. Good humor. Pumpkin pie. I did not know how to make pumpkin pie. Oh, yeah, sure. I'll give you hardwood. It's easy. Ten pieces of hardwood? Yeah. problem. Oh, that's right, I have no wood right now. <laughs> uh, wasn't there... Um... Like a secret Santa thing coming up that I was supposed to be preparing for? I just remembered that. Uh, what's it called? Like Feast of the Winter Star? It's on the 25th every winter. The event works like a secret Santa. Hmm. A week beforehand, on the 18th, Mara Lewis will send a letter telling you who your gift recipient is. Oh, wasn't it? It was Clint, and that's why I had the... That's why I had... That. Emeralds. Okay, okay, okay. I think that's what happened there. Yeah, well, he likes a ton of shit that I have, so whatever. That's what happened. Alright. I understand. Yeah. <laughs> All I'm figuring it out right now. <laughs> 